In the U.S. Army's Next Generation Squad Weapon Program, it showcases the newly developed XM-7 automatic rifle, the XM-250 light machine gun, and the XM-157 optical fire control system. The capabilities of these Sig Sauer made weapons are designed to kill or inflict severe damage on the human body. Is the U.S. Army still hesitant about being optimistic in competing with Russian body armor? Let's explore. The U.S. is replacing the M4 rifle and the M249 light machine gun. One of these replacements, the XM7, is designed for improved performance, cost efficiency, and battlefield effectiveness. It is highly accurate and equipped with 6.8 by 51 mm cartridges. It weighs 8.38 pounds. Its length is 36 inches with the suppressor and it features a 13-inch barrel. Meanwhile, the XM250 offers sustained fire capability while remaining controllable by soldiers in the field. This machine gun can fire 800 rounds per minute and is chambered for 6.8 by 51 mm. It weighs 13 pounds. The XM157 comes with advanced features not found in standard rifle optics. The features include engraved reticle, variable magnification optics, ballistic calculator, atmospheric sensor array, compass, intra-soldier wireless, laser rangefinder, visible and infrared laser aiming devices, and digital display overlay. The XM157 can engage targets up to 1,828 meters away, automatically adjusting for distance and bullet drop to strike targets more effectively at longer ranges. The Army previously acknowledged that its current 5.56 mm ammunition cannot penetrate Russian body armor. This realization has made the U.S. more optimistic about the development of its latest rifles. In fact, the Army plans to procure 111,428 XM-7 rifles, 13,334 XM-250 automatic rifles, and 124,749 XM-157 fire control devices by 2030. Will the prowess of these new American rifles be enough to penetrate Russian body armor? Leave your thoughts and thanks for watching.